What's going on, everybody? It's Mickey Indigo here with another show, and you already know, and you already know, I just need to uh, get something off my chest, man. I finished Cobra Kai. I binged it, man. It probably took me no more than a day to go ahead and get to the ending of season three of Cobra Kai, and I'm not going to put any spoilers, but I am going to give my first impressions. So without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and jump into it, but before I do, press that like button. Please subscribe. I love you all until the day that I die. Now, let's go ahead and jump into it. Now, Cobra Kai Season 3. I'm not going to jump into any spoilers. I see it's fresh. I know not everyone's a diehard fan like me. And, uh, you know, <laughs> what can I say, man? I am a super fan karate kid. I was when I'm young, when I was young, and I am now when I'm an adult, which is embarrassing, but I don't care. I'll admit it because Cobra Kai is awesome. And look... If you ask me, this is probably the best season. Um, it's kind of tied between season two and three, but I think season three, the production value is through the roof. Looks like they got a far bigger budget. Everyone's acting got a lot better. It's a lot less cheesy. I think, in my opinion, the only cheesy part in Cobra Kai was probably the second... Uh, I think it's the second episode in the Chop House. I'm not going to go ahead and ruin anything, but I thought that part was kind of cheesy. But other than that... I think it was pretty organic. I love the way it flowed. And oh my God, the ending. I'm not going to get even uh, into spoilers, like I said. But that ending with Miguel, his bag. Oh man, I'm not going to get into any spoilers. If you haven't watched it, you got to go ahead and watch it ASAP, man. I am so hyped. Oh, you got to watch Karate Kid 1, 2, and 3. Really, I'm telling you guys. It makes it all that much better. But, I mean, what can I say without going into spoilers? I'll probably make a spoiler video in about a week or two. But what can I say without going into spoilers, man? Miguel was awesome. His arc was awesome. Johnny is way more hilarious. I, dude, he had me crying laughing. Like, his dialogue is so much sharper in this season. Like, he had me dying laughing, man. LaRusso and his arc, whoa, that was incredible, man. If you ask me if you're Team Johnny or Team, um, you know, Daniel, I'm Daniel all day. I'm with Karate Kid from the start. And I know most people are probably Team Johnny because that's their first experience with uh, Karate Kid. But, dude... Let me know in the comments below. Are you Team Danny or are you Team Johnny? But yeah, let's let's uh, man his his uh, Sam. Whoa, what an arc! Uh, I thought that was actually a really good payoff. I was like, eh, I don't know, really good payoff. Um, dude, all the kids, all the kids, man, Hawk. Oh man, he was. He was heartbreaking, and he was awesome at the same time. It really was. Dude, they knocked it out of the park for this one, and I'm thinking the next season's probably going to be the final season, which is fine. You know, if they're going to go out, they better go out on a high note. But, man, this was way more brutal, way more dark, way better acted, way better written. Man, season two was incredible. I love season two, especially with that ending. But I'm not going to lie. If you're a fan of Karate Kid back in the day and you saw this ending, you would be like, dude, no way. Because you're like, you, you're thinking you're watching certain scenes. You're like, why are they showing me this? And then you're like, oh, that's why. <laughs> Man, like I said, the payoff is so much better if you watch Karate Kid 1, 2, and 3. But even if you haven't, man, it was still incredible. If you were to ask me, what do I give this rating? Dude, I don't know, man. I gave last season an 8. But they did amp it up more, man. I don't know. I really got to sit on it more, man. I really got to sit on it more. It's either on par with season 2. Or it's better than season two. It's definitely not a step down. But man, I was excited. I'm, I'm excited for you guys. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I'm Mickey Indigo. Please like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Remember, I'm going to be giving away a PS5 digital edition so go ahead and subscribe and i'm also going to be doing another giveaway that's actually happening really really soon so stay tuned guys stay there and uh, i apologize the video's been coming in a little bit late 
I've had a lot of stuff going on, personal things, but like I said, in about a week or two, I'll be up and at them, back at it again for another one. So until then, people, I love you all, and good night. And of course, that's a wrap. If you enjoyed this content, please like, share, and subscribe. Your continued support will keep this show going.